Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 9 of Hirogato Sky Pretty Cares. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. It is time! Even though this is last night, and I have been avoiding, like, videos like the freaking play, because I was like, I want to see his transformation, but I can't. It's not time for me. I would have watched this last night, but I was a little busy. He twy, he twying. Oh my god, he has a little baby. Uh, it's so funny because it's like <laughs> I want the bird. I just want him. He's so cute. We we have to add him to my collection of pretty hair plushies. I mean, this is the same person who still kind of wants to get um not that would be that, but the the, the puff is kind of the hardest one to get. Maybe Fua, even though, like, because I love the crap out of Fua, like, super bad. Um, Akareem, definitely, if I could find one, but it's hard. <laughs> it truly is. Mm -mm -mm. But I, mm, like I said, I've been avoiding the, the transformation scene. I was like, I don't want to see anything. I did see one person's um initial thoughts. They thought it was okay. And that kind of hurt my feelings because it's the first boy. So hopefully my expectations on it is a little like, better i just i won't know until i see but i am excited to see him <laughs> no <laughs> this i know but you think your, your dreams are gonna come true baby that's right How are you gonna get to it all? Hmm? We gonna roll? Okay, that'll work. And jump off of each other. Oh, perfect. Just, uh -uh. Oh no, help my baby. I have feeling about this too. No.
But it's okay. You got this. You got this. Oh, oh poor baby. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh. Oh, God. We're going to keep trying. Baby, no. Sir, how can we eat bananas at a time like this? And I don't like you. I, I really wish we would finally have somebody else. But no, it's only episode nine.
my god, baby. Come on. Shit. <laughs> I mean, you're the baby thief first. Right? <laughs> Just go. Uh, he's like right on their tail. Yeah, she trying. She really is. No.
can't move this shit. One stick on. Pretty care always making me cry. <laughs> I'm not ready for this. <laughs> It's really pretty. Like, I mean, mm, it might even be better than pretty. Well, it's not. No, it, it not might. It is. I mean, because they, uh, it, it's beautiful. I mean, Prism's is good, but as we said, Prism was missing something, and they was like, hey, we're giving it to. <laughs> I'm ready for all the freaking aerial battles. Just, oh my god, because he's just gonna be too so gay. <laughs> Oh fucking <laughs>
Now, see, my thing is he has to be added into this at least, like, what, next week? Or something tells me they're waiting for Agaha. That's the thing. Because as of right now, and looking at the list for the episodes in April, like, still, she's not, um, it's not her time yet. So she might be coming more, like, May. <laughs> oh my god, I'm crying and die because oh my god, he's dead. <laughs> oh. Sora. <laughs> He's so fucking cute. I can't. Like, oh my god. <laughs> I gotta die. Seriously. Okay, like transformation wise, like it's very beautiful. Like seriously, it just it, it's it's sky and then him and then prism. Prism, I'm sorry, baby. They just he just said no at her, and, I, and that's sad because it's like when you realize who her you is and who she is. One second, that's what happening. Oh my god, like, damn, like, she got the short end of the stick, and I hate that. I mean, because it's, like, she, it's very underrated, though, but y'all really did that. Y'all did that with him. <laughs> he looks so beautiful and handsome. Oh my god. I just, I also love the fact that, like, okay, when we first met him last week, and his hair, like, that was my, a little bit of my issue. I was like, how are they going to do that? Like, I mean, yes, the part is adorable. It just, it's also giving me vibes to freaking Saki with the one girl with her hair, like, literally down the middle where I feel like, ma'am, can you see? And, and it just, it went, it, they took the stakes and they was like, hey, we're just covering half of his face. And they're like, baby, can you see? And like, when they cover, uncovered his eyes, like, oh, he looks so pretty. I can't, oh my God. But yes, I'm really excited to see how, dynamic the arrow battles are, like well sky battles are going to get with him because of the fact is he essentially is what the first pretty girl who can fly yes um so air battles like top notch yeah i need y'all do that I'm also ready to see like just the dynamic between the three of these characters because of course we're building these three up even more up to the point when Agatha finally comes in as her pretty girl as butterfly and such and then it will be the four of them so once again again we claps for this show for doing this because like seriously they literally once again, took any little criticism that I had said or anyone else had said, and they were like, okay, we're doing this different. And we're going to give like a lot of more direction and development with these characters before someone else comes in. It's really nice. It does remind me of like what either Delicious or Healing Good, one of the two, where it was like, it was a couple of delicious didn't do this i think it was more of healing good healing good did like a couple of episodes where it was just nadoka and brabadeen slash cure grace and then we finally brought in the next cure and so i like that we're kind of continuing it with this series where we had sky in the beginning a couple episodes featuring sky then prism and then our duo together and now finally we have wing 
into the mix and we're going to go several episodes with giving them more development but also giving Agatha her own development so that by the time she is here she feels a little more fleshed out because of the times if you look at any of the other critical series and such sometimes it's not the greatest you know when they come in and you're just like damn you kind of wish you had more episodes focused on you and the next thing you know when you end the show <laughs> and you're going on to the next one and you have final thoughts and you get to that one character and you're like I really don't know what to say about you. I wish just the, you know, the staff did you a little teeny tiny bit better. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge to certain pretty cures in other series that I have watched and such. Or am currently re-watching. That's all I'll say for that. If you know, you know. And, and like, like I said, I think the biggest time I really went in was Star Twinkle. Like, <laughs> Uh, start to, in my opinion, Star Trickle Pretty Cure and my final thoughts on that, I think that will go down in history for me as the one where I was like, I can't beat around the bush on this. I literally have to talk about this because everybody was talking about that. That was the biggest thing that a lot of us really wanted to talk about for Star Twinkle. Yes, it's still good, but we also had our own little issues with that show and the fact is that I'm possibly going to rewatch that show only really um well no I can't talk about that yet we we can't talk about that yet I have to wait that's all um but just rewatch and talking about certain things but I think I will be talking about that too but that's all I'll say for that but guys he, he just it's so good he's so adorable I love him I just want the bird plush of him bad so hopefully I can find one very soon because he's too freaking cute and I love him so much and I just want to cuddle with him like I do with Komei Komei and Kudanun and he could just sleep in my bed because literally I fall asleep and the next thing you know I wake up 50 out of 50 one of them has fallen off my bed and then I get upset because I'm like oh god what happened and I'm like me uh, it's me I is what happened <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode 9 of Hiragana Sky Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. Really helps. <coughs> I cannot speak. Helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Enjoy the Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all <coughs> next Saturday for episode 10. Bye, guys.